This is Major Explorer 212, and finally we got some Doctor Who news on Stephen Moffat, 12th Doctor on the 50th anniversary air date and month. Uh, so here we go. Um, Entertainment Weekly has a great interview with Stephen Moffat that covers a wide range of hot topics, including the 12th Doctor, the 50th anniversary special, and Series 8. The notorious teasing head writer even answers a few of the questions fairly straight for a change. Here are some highlights. On when they will finally announce the 12th Doctor. Unless you have an insane plan, we'll announce a new Doctor within days of finalizing the new Doctor. I think we'll go public pretty fast. On the search for the 12th Doctor. Well, it's always just terrifying. When you're just suddenly faced with the reality you are going to sit there and you're going to make that decision, it does feel absolutely chilling. There's a very big range of people who could could play it in different ways you can go with. You, we must get this right. One false move and the show's over. On the gender of the next Doctor, I'm not going to comment at all on the direction we're going. Sorry. Uh-oh. Uh, on when we will see the 12th Doctor in the Christmas special, it'll be the traditional regeneration. You know the 11th will fall and the 12th shall rise, and you'll see that in the closing moments of the show. On whether Matt is going to need to wear a wig. We're sprinkling fertilizer on his head as we speak. The doctor will turn up in his trademark quiff. Uh, we can't have Matt's last stand in the TARDIS without his proper look. On whether Series 8 will broadcast late summer 2014. I think that's probably right, but these things change so often. Split. Could you say split? Um... On finding Matt, uh, on finding out Matt was leaving. Well, I've known, broadly speaking, for a very long time, while a very long while, because I knew how long. When he first came in, he was broadly speaking intending to do, uh, and obviously, being the man I am, I always tried to persuade him to do longer and to do more, and he stayed a little bit longer than intended to. I knew that he would do what most of of them do and do his three years um, on when Matt actually told Moffat he was leaving we discussed ages ago that we would do three series and then we would do the 50th and then we do Christmas that was plan A for a very very long time uh, that may sound cold that it was so far in advance but you've got to plan a career uh, and he laughed so the question was will I be able to talk him out of it we went out for lunch, and he said that he'd come very close to doing another series, but it was the same argument. If I do another series, I think I might do two more series, or three more series. I might, I think I might never leave. It's just the thing I'm wanting to leave while you're a huge hit, and not to let it tail off. On the length of the 50th anniversary special, I think you could call it movie length. Yeah, I mean, I'm saying that with a slight hint of vagueness, because I don't know the finishing run time. And he laughs. He laughs, Moffat. Um, it's certainly well over an hour. On what was it uh, like having Matt and David together? They really loved each other and had a huge laugh together. And of course, they've been through this experience that only the two of them could talk about, really, in the modern world. Uh, they are two people that have played the, that part at a time when the series is this big. Uh, they spend the entire time just sitting there talking adamantly. Okay? Um, on how Tennant and Smith's doctors react to each other. They're quite a fun pairing, I would say. There's a bit of a normal joshing at each other, but they're both such enthusiastic doctors. While they might uh, be sort of... Uh, competing slightly, they're both standing there saying, oh god, it's so cool, there's two of me. So it's very different. I think the other one that worked brilliantly was John Pertwee and Patrick Troughton. They were incredibly funny together. This is very different from that, but it's a sublime double act. On John Hurt's Doctor, you get a whole new Doctor played on by a proper screen legend on Moffat's future. Uh, I've signed up for the next year with the new Doctor. It's one of those jobs when you know when you've had enough. At the moment, I haven't had enough, and I'm thoroughly enjoying it. Uh, I'm very excited for the challenge of the new Doctor and establishing that the new Doctor, uh, and establishing the new Doctor. So, no plans to leave as yet. So, he's staying around. 
for contractly another year, but he may stay longer, okay? And that's the Doctor Who News from Doctor TV UK. Uh, get better, Doctor Freedom. Take care. Bye for now.